You know what they say about payback? Well, tonight, it's welcome. An agreement between TME Enterprises and VDOT means money is available to pay for repairs because of February's pothole disaster on 264. Tenor Your Side has covered this story extensively, and Andy Fox joins us now with the good news. Andy? Yeah, there's a lot of good news out there. This is the settlement agreement to pay back pothole victims. Good news for the 20 getting back money and a possible 22 others who will also be reimbursed. An estimated 140 claims were considered, and yesterday the good news started going out. 96 days after she hit a pothole on 264, Ted on your side viewer Nicole Luster got back $330 for her flat tire and alignment problems. She is ecstatic. It was pretty painless. I mean, she, she gave me a check. We did have to sign some um, release forms, but other than that, um, they just gave you a check. They were pretty friendly. Luster was called yesterday and went down to pick up her money from TME. It's all part of a signed May 7th agreement between TME and VDOT. The third party claims agreement. TME and VDOT split all claims up to $4,000, but VDOT only pays a maximum of $1,000 per claim. TME pays the rest. 140 total claims were considered. VDOT and TME are paying 22 claims, totaling $15,666. VDOT will pay $7,187 of it, TME $8,479. 20 additional claims are also under consideration. 10 on your side has followed Luster, has made calls on her behalf, and today she's justly rewarded. I really want to thank 10 on your side because I don't think without 10 on your side we would have gotten our money back because truly I feel like they were dragging their feet. They were, you know, they didn't think it was a big deal that they kind of dropped the ball, but you guys stuck with us. You guys kept reporting on it. You guys kept checking up on us and you've made them stick to their word. Yes, and Ted on your side always thought it was a big deal. We followed four victims. Luster's getting her $330. Another victim, Pete Che, is getting back $830. Two others have not qualified for reimbursements. Ironically, today at midnight was the last day on the job for TME. TME, now listen to this, lost about $35 million of work when they lost renewal of their VDOT contract over this pothole issue. $35 million. Who says potholes don't matter? They do. You can go online at wavy.com and see the settlement agreement between TME and VDOT. In the newsroom, Andy Fox, 10 on your side.